Hey everyone and welcome to our channel. This video will be a guide on how to use ShipStation with Shopify. Whether you're just launching your e-commerce business or are looking to switch to a better shipping solution, ShipStation is an extremely popular choice. By the end of this video, you'll be fully equipped to start leveraging ShipStation to streamline your e-commerce order fulfillment and make shipping a breeze. I recommend staying until the end of this video so you don't miss out on any important parts. But first, what exactly is ShipStation? At a higher level, ShipStation is a web-based shipping software that helps e-commerce businesses manage and ship their orders with ease. Some key things that ShipStation enables you to do is that you can import orders from all major e-commerce platforms and marketplaces, you can compare the shipping rates across carriers and choose the best option. A key feature is print shipping labels and packing slips in bulk with just a few clicks. You can automate and streamline the repetitive shipping task which is important for saving time. You can sync inventory levels and order status across the channels. So in short, ShipStation serves as your complete order fulfillment command center, centralizing all your inbound orders, inventory and logistics in one place. So as you can see, there are many benefits of using ShipStation from time saving to lower costs and accuracy. This is extremely important for high volume merchant fulfilling lots of orders every single day. ShipStation comes in as an invaluable tool for shipping efficiency and cost savings. Now that we know what ShipStation is and why businesses use it, let's understand how exactly the software works. When you first land on ShipStation.com, you will see three key sections that give you an overview. The first one is to connect. ShipStation connects all major e-commerce platforms, marketplaces and carriers. The second one will be to manage. Once orders are imported, you can manage them within ShipStation. That includes printing labels, sending shipment tracking, updating inventory, and more. And finally, we have the automate function. This is where ShipStation automates repetitive tasks like status updates, customer emails, inventory syncing, and way more. This saves you a lot of time. So as you can see, the homepage gives a great overview of how ShipStation serves as the hub connecting your sales channels all the way to order automation. Let's take a look at the pricing. ShipStation offers several paid subscription plans scaled for different business sizes and shipping volumes. Unfortunately, there is no free plan, but you can sign up for a free 30-day trial as a new user to test it. You won't even need to use your credit card, so definitely be sure to give this tool a try within the free 30-day trial, and if you found good value from it, which I think you will, then you can decide to upgrade for a plan. Which takes us to the four main paid pricing tiers. You've got the startup one for $25 a month. This allows for up to 500 shipments per month and up to three users. The second tier is the most popular one, which is called Accelerate. This is for $65 a month and you'll be getting up to 3000 shipments per month and up to five users. Scale for $155 per month, you will be getting up to seven 1,500 shipments monthly and up to 10 users. And finally, we have the enterprise one. You'll have to get in touch with the ShipStation support and you can then agree on a custom shipment fee and unlimited amount of shipments per month. And you will then get access to more than 10 users. And as it says here, it's 10 plus. I don't know what the highest ceiling is, but I'm gonna assume that it is limited because otherwise they would have typed unlimited. So I would recommend that you assess your current and projected order volumes to choose the right plan for you. There is no commitment to these plans, so you can always upgrade within the ship station if your shipping needs grow. But honestly, the pricing is quite reasonable even at the highest tiers. The features and capabilities unlocked at the higher tiers make the incremental investment very worthwhile for serious e-commerce businesses. Are you ready to give ShipStation a try? Signing up is quick and easy, just follow these steps. Go to ShipStation.com, click the button where it says try it for free, enter your business email address and then a password for your new account, fill in all of the company details such as your name, industry, projected monthly shipment volumes, then agree to the terms of service, verify your email address by clicking the confirmation link sent, and after a short while your new account should be provisioned. Once you've received a welcome email, your account will be ready, click to log in and see your dashboard. And that's it, within a few minutes, you will have a fully functioning ShipStation account ready to connect your sales channels and start shipping. Again, the free trial will give you 30 days to thoroughly test down the platform at no cost. Let's now go through the key steps to start configuring your account. The first thing we'll need to do is to start connecting our sales channels. This is where you connect your e-commerce sales channels and it imports your orders for fulfillment. Under account settings, click sales channels and select add new. Here you can connect to all the major platforms ShipStation supports such as Shopify, eBay, Etsy and so on. Every platform will vary slightly for the setup but it generally involves selecting the channel you want to connect and then entering the platform credentials. It will ask you to allow data access when prompted and then it will test your connection and flicking the channel live. 
You can also connect as many sales channels as you sell on the centrally managed orders across all platforms and marketplaces in one dashboard. Next up, we want to add the shipping carriers. This gives access to the discounted rates and automates label generation. Simply go to shipping carriers in the main menu and here you will see a list of all the supported domestic and international carriers. Choose the major carriers you plan to ship with. The options will include UPS, FedEx, DHL, and you will see many more right there. So simply click add provider to follow the steps to securely connect your shipping accounts. And this allows ShipStation to access your negotiated rates. You can always compare rates across carriers and easily print the labels. Don't skip the step. And speaking of labels, you'll also want to configure a label printer for batch printing shipping labels through ShipStation. So under printing, select printers and then choose your target printer model, then adjust the settings like the label size, print mode, laser versus direct thermal. You've got label orientation, units of measure, number of copies. Save your settings once configured for your label printer of choice. Many common models like Zebra and Dymo are preloaded. You'll then be able to print batches of shipping labels with one click as you process the orders. Also, don't forget to provide your business location. So go to shipping and then from there, ship from locations. You'll have to enter details like your location name, company, address, phone, and any other special instructions that you have. This informs ShipStation where your inventory ships from. It's used to calculate transit times and the label rates. Add all of your warehouse or store locations if you ship from multiple places. This is easy to toggle between them when processing the orders. Now that was the initial setup. Now you can start to import real orders to see ShipStation in action. Head over to the order section and select awaiting shipment. Early on, this will be empty until we import orders. And then in the top right, click the update button. Choose which connected sales channels you want to sync the latest orders from. Then give it a few minutes to connect and import your unfulfilled orders from platforms like Shopify or eBay. The orders will be then populated. You can also click the individual orders and view details, customize ad tracking, print labels, and more. And that should be it for the importing section. I also want to highlight the ShipStation's excellent analytics under the report section. You will get full visibility into critical shipping KPIs like the number of shipments by date, carrier or service. You'll have delivery speed and exceptions, carrier scorecards, frequently shipped products, inventory forecasts and much more. Leveraging these insights to measure your shipping performance, catch issues, identify savings opportunities and make the data-driven decisions. ShipStation integrates with Google Analytics for deeper analysis, but the built-in reporting is incredibly powerful. Don't forget to keep learning, testing new features, and refining your workflows over time to get the most from this powerful platform. ShipStation can truly transform and scale your e-commerce business to the moon. The platform handles so many pain points, saving you time and money. Also, if you're only just starting your Shopify journey, then I highly suggest that you sign up with the link in our description down below. It will grant you a temporary offer where you can open your Shopify store for only $1 per month for three consecutive months. So be absolutely sure to grab that offer before it's too late. If you have any other questions regarding this platform or Shopify in general, feel free to leave them in the comment section down below. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you found it enjoyable or informative to watch. And if you don't want to miss the follow-up content we make on Shopify then be sure to subscribe to the channel. Thank you once again for watching and see you guys next time.